Josh Hart exercised his player option for next season at $13 million. Hart had the chance to decline that option and test free agency where he presumably would have re-signed with the Knicks on a deal worth much more than $13 million next season. So Hart sacrifices short term financially, but he will be eligible for a four year extension worth around $80 million starting in August. So I would assume Hart and the Knicks come to some kind of an agreement on that extension. But also this move gives the Knicks some financial flexibility heading into free agency. They have their eye on Dante DiVincenzo going into free agency. They will have competition on DiVincenzo from teams like the Bulls, Timberwolves, and Pistons. But if they can offer the money that, let's say, the Bulls and the T-Wolves can in that exception, and everything's equal, I think DiVincenzo chooses New York.